Last week, a widespread crypto meltdown resulted from Bitcoin's big fall, wiping off $1 trillion from the market. However, despite the market's fragile conditions, promising altcoins like Cardano have held up admirably. But will Cardano double its market cap? Will it continue its bull run to shine as it approaches the $10 milestone? Stay tuned until the end to find out. Hi, Cardano lovers! Welcome to Cardano Land, your daily dose of Cardano. If you're interested in everything around Cardano, this is the place for you. Make sure to hit the like button and subscribe for us to provide you with more Cardano news. And let us know in the comments how much you think Cardano will cost by the end of this month. Let's get to it. The content in this video is for entertainment purposes only and hence should not be considered as financial advice. All the financial decisions should be made after doing your own research. Even as interest in Bitcoin, BTC, and Ether ETH fell last week, institutional inflows into Cardano ADA investment products increased substantially. This demonstrates the emergence of proof-of-stake assets amid the latest wave of environmental FUD in the markets. According to CoinShares, institutional investment managers acquired $10 million worth of ADA products in the week ending Monday. More money was invested in Cardano investment funds than in any other digital asset. During the same week, Bitcoin funds had a $110.9 million outflow, while Ether funds experienced a $12.6 million outflow. According to CoinShares, investors put $5.5 million into Polkadot funds and $7.1 million into multi-asset investment packages. Cardano investment products have attracted $24 million in institutional assets so far this year, compared to $4.13 billion for Bitcoin and $924 million for Ether. CoinShares attributed the unexpected shift toward proof-of-stake cryptocurrencies like Cardano to environmental backlash against Bitcoin. Last week's flash fall in Bitcoin's price to below $30,000 unleashed a tidal wave of selling in the market, with Ether, Cardano, and every other major altcoin making fresh local bottoms. Bitcoin exchange volumes soared to $155 billion last week, a new all-time high according to CoinShares. On Monday, markets appeared to be on the mend, albeit it's still a little bit too early to proclaim a bottom. Before the market crash last week, ADA was one of the best-performing cryptos. As it burst above $2 on its way to new highs above $2.40, the cryptocurrency reached a series of highs. ADA was up 33.5% to $1.50, giving it a market capitalization of $47.9 billion. The Cardano ADA network has officially reached a new milestone, with 1 million wallets established. Thousands of new wallets are being created every day as more people join the network. So, the milestone came at a good time. The Cardano community Twitter account published the news, noting that over 70% of all ADA tokens in existence, worth roughly $34 billion, are staked in approximately 2,500 active pools throughout the world. Furthermore, the account stated that $500 million in ADA had been assigned to charity-focused activities on the Cardano network, implying that the benefits gained by these tokens for safeguarding the network have been donated to more than 100 philanthropic organizations around the world. According to Daily Hold, Cardano fan Pieta Nero stated on social media that hundreds of new ADA wallets are generated every day, even on days when the cryptocurrency's price falls. The network will expand in the coming months as it prepares for major enhancements. Input Output Hong Kong, IOHK, the company behind it, has announced that smart contract functionality will be added in the coming months allowing for the development of decentralized applications on its network. Furthermore, the company has announced the launch of a converter that will allow investors to convert ERC-20 tokens from the Ethereum blockchain into equivalent Cardano-based tokens, allowing them to interact with Cardano protocols. The price of Cardano's ADA has skyrocketed in recent months. According to Crypto Compare data, the cryptocurrency has increased by 2,900% in the last 12 months despite the current cryptocurrency market crash affecting its price performance. Cardano developer Charles Hoskinson said in an Ask Me Anything AMA session, as reported by CryptoGlobe, that he is now a cryptocurrency billionaire, despite the cryptocurrency market meltdown. 
Investors could not expect 900% price increases without pullbacks, he said in response to the decline. Cardano was created in 2017 by Charles Hoskinson as an energy-efficient alternative to Ethereum. Given Ethereum's growing gas cost, the proof-of-stake crypto is a flexible alternative. There are currently 32 billion ADA tokens in circulation, out of a total supply of 45 billion. Ethereum is the smart contract market leader, but its energy consumption is a serious worry. As energy costs rise, customers will be less likely to use the network, making Cardano the ideal alternative. With that in mind, let's take a closer look at the situation in order to have a better grasp of Cardano's strong position. Cardano's bull run has been nothing short of spectacular, with a gain of over 2,500% in just over a year. Other cryptocurrencies have seen healthy gains in value over the last year, for much the same reasons. The crypto markets have been fueled by the depreciation of global currencies. Governments all around the world have raised the money supply at breakneck speed, causing fiat currencies to depreciate. As a result, for the first time, Bitcoin became the preferred deflationary asset among institutional investors, and other cryptocurrencies climbed alongside it. Cardano has a lot of potentials to become the market's most valuable green cryptocurrency. It is based on a proof-of-stake algorithm that reduces miners' payouts in order to increase the network efficiency. It also has a number of catalysts that might push its price over $10 in the not-too-distant future. Ethereum is the smart contract platform of choice for NFT purchases. If Cardano can get a competitive advantage in the smart contract space, a large amount of money could pour into the ADA coin. As a result, Cardano's engineers must ensure that the smart contract platform is launched as soon as possible. For the previous seven days, Cardano's price has been hovering around the 50-day simple moving average SMA, and it's on track to end May with a double-digit gain. ADA will see increased volatility on a daily basis, but it's still well positioned to be one of the major digital tokens in the future. According to the latest CoinShares Digital Asset Fund Flows Weekly Report, digital assets had net institutional outflows for the second week in a row, totaling $97 million, a new high. To put it into context, it only accounts for 0.2% of overall assets under management AUM, and pales in comparison to the $5.5 billion in net inflows thus far this year. Following $115 million in withdrawals the previous week, Bitcoin saw total outflows of $110.9 million. BTC had outflows of over $100 million for the second week in a row. Ethereum had outflows of $12.9 million. But this is a modest setback in a year when the smart contracts currency saw record-breaking inflows. Positive sentiment remains strong in altcoins, with inflows topping $27 million. With $10 million in institutional inflows, Cardano had the most. It was the second week of ADA inflows, bringing the total YTD inflows for Cardano institutional investment products to $24 million. The large inflows could represent investors actively choosing proof-of-stake currencies based on environmental considerations, according to Coinbase. Because of the significant impact mining has on the environment, environmental concerns have taken center stage in the cryptocurrency world. When Elon Musk determined that Tesla would no longer accept BTC as a payment option due to the massive power demand, which is mostly sourced from fossil fuels, he was helpful in bringing such issues to the attention of the mainstream media. Cardano's price had dropped over 50% for the day, over 60% from its all-time high of $2.51 on May 19th, and the downturn had wiped out the 180% gain from the April 23rd low. ADA, on the other hand, had recovered by 50% by the conclusion of the day, putting it above the tactically significant 50-day SMA. Cardano's price was hit by another wave of significant selling pressure on May 23rd, sending the digital token down about 30% at the intraday low, although ADA rebounded by 25%. Despite the recent volatility, the Cardano price has remained inside two key price levels. The 2018 high of $1.39 and the high of $1.54 on February 27th. The 50-day SMA at $1.46 is sandwiched between the two price levels. In the medium term, Cardano's price is likely to bounce between the two price levels and the 50-day SMA, releasing price compression from the previous week's volatility. 
It's important to notice that Cardano's price is forming an inverse head and shoulders pattern on the 4-hour chart, which might trigger in the next few hours. The opportunistic formation's trigger price is $1.66, which is slightly higher than the 50-hour SMA of $1.63. The 61.8% Fibonacci retracement of the May fall at $1.68, the May 20th peak at $1.98, and the 78.6% retracement at $1.99 are all key resistance levels. A daily closing below yesterday's low of $1.23 would signal a severe drop in Cardano price, maybe to the May 23rd low of $1.04 or even to the May 19th low of $0.91. If ADA falls below its April low of 89 cents, it will begin a longer-term secular slide. Cardano has been one of the most successful altcoins since the beginning of the year. Wallets for Cardano increased by 40% in the first month of 2021. With a slew of catalysts in place, it has the potential to break through the $10 barrier by the end of the year. However, Cardano's developers must first continue to improve the platform and make progress towards its goals. And let us know in the comments how much you think Cardano will cost by the end of this month. And make sure to subscribe and give a thumbs up. See you next time at Cardano Land.